Hey everybody, I would like to share with you a banner that I made with the beautiful Christmas banner kit that Doreen, um, oh my goodness, sent. It is absolutely beautiful. Oh my goodness. I just finished this and it is so Christmassy. I love it. Thank you, Doreen. So I want to share it with you real quick. I, um, I took, um, what was I going to say? Anyways, I made pennants. I was going to make three, but you know, as you go along, your your plan kind of changes a little bit for me, anyways. I um I haven't put any modeling paste or any of that kind of stuff on it yet, because I just finished and I wasn't sure if I want to go glittery or snowy. But I wanted to show you. Just um, I'm pretty much that's all I need to do. Um, but what I did was I knew I wanted to make a banner, so I made the pennants, and these are like six by eight. And then I just, yeah, dressed up each pennant like this. It's pretty big. The pieces are pretty big. And, um, what I did was I laid down the, the two pennants that come in this kit, or I think there might be three. I used two at the top of this uh, banner here, at the pennant. I put down the crocheted, I can't even see it now because I covered it up, but you can see it like underneath. So, I, so it's draping down here, and then I used that beautiful trim that came in the kit here, with the lace and then the ribbon, and I just used some from my stash, just to give it um, more dimension, because I just like that, you know, sometimes I get carried away. But, um, that's not too bad. I just thought it filled it up a little more because these pennants kind of came out kind of big. That's really why. And then I just punched this out with my um, Stampin' Up Scallop Punch and then just placed a flower there. And then these are just little twigs from a branch. And then this beautiful trim. I love this Doreen. It reminds me of Santa Claus's beard. I think I already mentioned that. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. But I just put it here and with a, a piece of bling and then this beautiful trim here. Gorgeous. So I did that and then I just had some trim from my stash that some white like eyelet trim that I spritzed up with the Prima pink spray. And then this is, you know, the the popular Hobby Lobby flower trim and I just thought it went beautiful with this but what I did that I love that beautiful um, blingy oh it's just it's got that beautiful gold thread in it um, I'm very sleepy y'all I'm yeah I'm in a lack for words here but um, the shimmery beautiful material here. I placed it in the center here. I wish I knew I was going to do that. It would have been easier because I had to tuck once I realized I wanted to put it right here. But I love how that turned out. That, that is so pretty. So pretty. And then I cut out with my Sizzix die, the Brenda Walton um, bird die, this bird with the cereal box. I love to recycle. And then I embossed it with a Brenda Walton embossing folder. I uh, used the primrose paper and then this beautiful sparkly trim that came in the kit. Isn't that gorgeous? And this one came out perfect because it landed and it looks like the bird has an eye right there. Isn't that pretty? I love how that turned out. So what I did was I took, I made this centerpiece. This is one of those big ornaments that you can get from the Dollar Tree. And I bought like three of them, two this color and one real gold. The real gold one didn't go because I was going to use it thinking it might go with this material, but it was too, too gold. So I thought, yeah, this color was, it's a little more subdued, very pretty. Used the beautiful doily in the kit here with the flower and placed it right there for my stash, a flower for my stash. Oh, I forgot to tell you, um... The doilies in the kit I placed, as you can see, around the banner here. I placed one here and then put that bling there with this trim. I love that, Doreen. I love this kit, honey. And then this beautiful trim here. Yeah. It's stretchy. Look how pretty that looks in the middle with the birds. Isn't that beautiful? And then that centerpiece right there that came in the kit, that beautiful sequence. 
Oh, that's beautiful. Applique, gorgeous. This is so Christmassy to me, y'all. I hope y'all like it because I absolutely love it. And then, you know, this big old ornament from the Dollar Tree. And then here's the other bird I did here with that beautiful material, Doreen. That is gorgeous material and perfect for Christmas. Beautiful. Love that. And then this right here is just like the other one, but you know, on the, just on this side. And then this trim here. So what I did first was I, I was going to make the um, Merry Christmas ornament the center. So I would dress it up a little bit with that trim. So I'm going to do something else with it. But I love this ornament. I might just make it hang on the tree like that. Oh, yeah. Isn't that beautiful? So, yeah, I wanted to share with you real quick this banner. It is absolutely gorgeous. The, all the um, trims and bling and beautiful pieces to work with. And, Doreen, yes, honey, your kits are absolutely outstandingly beautiful so thank you so much Doreen and thank you everyone for stopping by I pray you're having a wonderful day and enjoying the beautiful Christmas season beautiful beautiful time of year I just yeah it really is the most wonderful time of the year it really is so I'll stop rambling I just was excited and wanted to share this with you I'm going to go ahead and upload it and again thank you for stopping by and I'll be back bye now